Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Octopath Traveler. So today, we're finally getting to Primrose's story. We're finally almost in the final stretch of the game. 90 hours in. I mean, a lot of that is just sitting around doing nothing, but... <laughs> while I'm waiting for shit to do. But anyways, let's get started. Primrose, Chapter 2, let's go. The story so far. Primrose has embarked on her journey at last. Her quarry, three men, mark the sign of the crow. She hunts for the men who killed her father. After years of waiting and listening, she at last has a clue. So she hunts the man marked on his left arm. She is guided by a hard-won map, stolen from her former master, Helganish, with deadly force. The path has been a long one, but she comes at last to Still Snow, the frozen town where she was told she might find the man she seeks. Well, their paths cross at last in this cold land. Father. No. All right, so let's go to the green on the mini map. What a girl. I. <laughs> Lady Primrose. What? Yes. <laughs> In truth, how about it? Oh, um, actually. What? 
Liar. This place. In truth. What? Yes. So then... How about it? What? I'll do what I must. Lady Primrose. Lady Primrose. I think not. No. If you'll excuse me. Lady Primrose. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. 
fine then. All right, let's go. tried enough. Now you must be still and reflect upon why you continue to fail. You are my daughter, the lone daughter of House Azelheart. You must be strong, stronger than you are now. Yes, father. Answer me this, Primrose. What is required of the head of a great house? The Lady of House Azelheart? The Lady of House Azelheart... ...must safeguard her family's success and glory. She must be strong enough that no other house might overshadow our own. A fair answer. But hear me well, Brimrose. Worth is not found in the eyes of others. That which truly matters most lies within. What the head of our house must value above all is faith. Faith. Faith shall be your shield. These are our house words, and what they mean is that you cannot waver until you have done what you know in your heart of hearts must be done. It is the determination to keep your eyes fixed on the path before you, though a thousand indignities may seek to trip you up along the way. You must find that faith in yourself. Yes, Father. Primrose, I would entrust this dagger to you. Our words are engraved upon the blade. See that they are engraved upon your heart as well. Lady Primrose, are you all right? Ariana... You must have been very weary. I... I was just thinking about Father. 
Even in my memories, he will not stop lecturing me on how to live my life. Lord Azelhart was a man of unwavering principles. That he was. He taught me the sword, he taught me my letters, he taught me what it meant to live with dignity and honor. <laughs> he taught me all that I know. He always told me, choose wisely what to believe in and have faith in your beliefs, for that faith shall be your shield. Do I believe in? My lady? End of the line. Here we are. That's right. Faith shall be my shield. Lady Primrose, what is it that you believe in? Arion swallowed the question, her words hanging in the air. She feared what the answer might be. What was that? No. All right, let Lady me play. Primrose. Let me play. Let me play. It's been like a cutscene for the last 18 minutes. Yeah, I got murdering to do. Let's go. Thank you. And as always, follow the lamps, the lanterns, the fire, follow the light. Meanwhile. Well, look what we have here.
I beg your pardon. Yes. Good. Hmm. I am exceedingly grateful. The mark of the crow on your left arm. So we finally meet again. Do you have any idea how long I've waited for this day? Have we met, my lady? No, wait. You do look familiar. Didn't I see you dancing on a stage in some desert town? Think back further. I am Primrose Azelheart. Primrose Azelheart? The young lady of House Azelheart? My, how far from home you've come. Do you remember now? Do you remember me? My house? My father? Jeffrey. Hazelheart. Yes, I remember him quite well. The man knew how to handle a sword. And he was no fool. It wasn't easy to bring him down. Though, bring him down, we did. For all his virtues, your father made far too many enemies. It's not good for one's health, you see. What crime would you lay at his feet? What could he possibly have done to deserve death? He came to know something which he had no right to know. And it fell to my friends and I to sweep things back under the rug. I see. But surely you know well enough. Strike against another, and you invite a strike in return. <laughs> Is that so? This dagger has never left my side. I have not relinquished it once. Just as my memories of my father have never left me. He always told me to be true to my beliefs. To have faith in myself and never fail to carry out what I knew must be done. You three bearing the mark of the crow. I will kill you all. That is the only thing I believe in now. That is my reason for being. 
Be prepared to meet your fate, Crow. <laughs> you aren't the first to say such words to me. Like as not, you won't be the last. I will bury you, as I've buried all the rest. I am Rufus, the left wing of the Crow. Now come, precious daughter of House Azelheart. I will send you to your father's side. Finally. It's time for the main event. Letting the hunt begin. It. Well, not vulnerable to both. Okay. What is the logical course of action? Lux Gunger Gear? Lux Gunger Gear! I am ready. If thou darest. A blunt blow fall apart. An interesting dilemma. Lux conjure in. I am ready. Well, good night, Rufus. Windhield, fight for this. The hunt endeth. Oh, my. Lady Primrose. That's right. Lady Primrose. Thank you very much. Faith shall be your shield. Lady Primrose.
Farewell. So Primrose departs from Still Snow, the path before her yet long. Two men still await the kiss of a Hodega, and now she knows where the next stop on her journey will be. The truth will be found in Noblecote, in her hometown. She, so she turns her feet to the flatlands, returning to the beginning in hopes she might bring her journey to an end. Okay, so this seems like a good place as any to leave this episode, and I hope to see you in the next. Thanks for watching. If you want, there's a playlist to the left, a random video to the right, and if you want, you can follow me on Twitter at CGPoorly.